Researchers are hoping a new cell discovery will lead to strides when it comes to future treatments for degenerative neurological diseases. Health reporter Haley Hernandez live in the newsroom with the details. Haley? Yeah, Christine. So the research was led by investigators at the Ohio State University Wexner Medical Center and may help those suffering from diseases like ALS and multiple sclerosis. If this translates to, to the clinic and um, it, it actually is successful, it'll be, you know, a game changer. For more than 30 years as a neurologist, Dr. Benjamin Segal has watched patients slowly succumb to diseases like multiple sclerosis. But now he and a team at Ohio State University's Wexner Medical Center say they've discovered a new type of immune cell tested in mice that they hope will lead to new treatments, not only for those with degenerative neurological diseases, but also people suffering from brain or spinal cord damage and even stroke. What we're all pursuing is better ways to make our patients function better um, and to reclaim lost um, skills and abilities. Dr. Segal says the cell tested in mice can save dying nerve cells and stimulate regrowth when nerve fibers are damaged. He says they've also identified an immune cell line in humans with similar characteristics that promotes nervous system repair. The next step is to harness this cell in a lab and hopefully then one day inject it into patients. There's a really tremendous potential with this new approach. There sure is. It is their hope that these cells can help improve function and mobility while also slowing or stopping neurological degeneration. And guys, I'm going to be back at 6 p.m. tonight with an all new story on MISC, the COVID complication that's affecting children. This is the first time that we've heard from a local kid who has recovered from the illness, and he explains really just how bad it got for him, while doctors will also tell you signs that parents can watch out for. Keith? All right, we'll be looking for that at six o'clock. Haley, thank you.